Atlantic Ocean is known for its strong swell and unremitting wind. So arrangements are essential for coming to Lanzarote. Here, one of the best gliding flights ever will be awaiting the visiting pilots. Because of the action of the sun, the closer the air is to the equator, the warmer it will get. As it gets warm, it expands and rises, so pressure decreases. When the air molecules reach the tropopause, they are forced to head for the poles, while slowing temperature in the process. Near parallel 30 degrees, because of the accumulation and temperature, the air comes down again, compressing, heating and stacking itself so generally high pressure forms. As a consequence of the Earth's rotation in the Northern Hemisphere, the wind will blow clockwise in anticyclones. Due to the accumulation of the air, pressure increases in the centre of the anticyclone, so the air particles tend to travel down to low pressure, though they get turning inertia along the ice bars. In Lanzarote, this means that most of the time the wind blows from the northeast. Lanzarote has one of the lowest reliefs in the Canary Islands, no higher than 700 meters. Finding flyable days depends on the intensity of the prevailing trade winds on the island, partially in spring and most of the summer, when close high pressures protect the island from depression. The island has a slightly elongated morphology, 
which happen to coincide with the direction of the trade wind. This circumstance will cause great acceleration of the wind in the slopes facing east and west. The entry point of this movement will be located at Orzola, which is usually the least windy area. When September comes, pilots are encouraged to start a new flying season. At this time of year, the wind direction will be variable and its intensity can be reduced significantly. We will enjoy days with high visibility and thermal inversions higher than usual, which will allow us to fly up to 900 meters and even 1200 meters at the level of cloud base on most occasions. This figure is unlikely to be higher. I enjoy flying for the simple reason that I don't have to think about my normal life. It's a way of getting away and not thinking about anything else except nature and the will to stay up in the air. Me gusta volar en Canarias porque no hace frío. En Europa hace mucho frío y aquí no. When high pressures move far away, the whole island becomes unprotected at the mercy of the action of fronts or storms that occasionally approach the Canaries. When they do not fully reach the island, we can still find a flying site. Lanzarote offers some low takeoffs that allow us to fly. With most other sites, it would not be possible. That's the case for El Cuchillo a crater located almost at sea level in a most exotic scenery. <laughs>